Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Floppy Night. So we finished up all the recent challenges that we had from the lava levels, and now we're heading on over to the science fair. Alrighty, defeat all enemies or capture the flag. Increase the unit's attack to eight or more. So I'm assuming increasing their attack to eight or more, I have to use this guy and get him up. So maybe I do need to look to go to actually make. Alrighty, let's go ahead and add a second attack here. Gains one attack, takes two self damage. Interesting. Okay, well, let's go ahead and add our usuals. So we'll add that, we'll add that. One of each of these, we'll add that. And what do we say now? We can get two more. Uh, we'll want to use this to increase him up. Definitely going to want to take that. I believe that is all we will go ahead and take for this round. Two self damage, draw two cards. Because I don't actually have to attack with him. So we'll give that a try. Okay. So yeah, we just have to increase it to eight or more. Alright! Oh! Gives us a second deck to try out, so we'll see how this goes. Alrighty, so we be a part of this science fair games going against um, some kind of vampire lady. And I'm already seeing a 12 unit there. Yep, great and all. Alright, we gotta go with our monster deck this time. Ooh, what do we got here? Got a whole bunch of new units we gotta keep an eye on. So we got to get to that flag. And then bring it back. Not set on any amounts of time. Okay, so I think I'd rather Big Bad be on this side of it. Alright, what do we got here? Two attack, three speed, counterattack enemies in ranged when damaged. Okay. One attack, four speed, can fly freely. Four attack, two speed, no secondaries. Okay, so we got to get to the button. As long as I can hover over those, we should be good to go. Uh, armored 2, add press the attack, attack an enemy and add an attack card to your hand. Not too bad. So bull rush, move, uh, move 2 plus extra tiles, can only move, that's right, can only move in a straight line. And I only start with an attack of one, but we can already do that, which is going to be pretty nice. Get our Spatunia out. I can move any unit that I want to. So we can go ahead and just play the other guy here. And I do believe we should be safe going into the next turn. If I can get the self-damage one, I can already start doing damage onto him. Bats are spawning there. I'd be willing to assume these soldiers are spawning over there. Perfect. Just what I was looking for, along with an extra kicker. Let's draw a card. Alrighty. That doesn't cost anything, so we'll take two damage. Gain that extra two attack. Beautiful. Two self-damage and another added attack. Beautiful again. Alright, so we can move to here, do our free attack. And we can do another one with another attack. See, this is where it gets nice. Two attack, one attack. We'll be able to take that no problem. And I'm also in a forest tile, so that's good. We can play our succulent kicker. We're gonna be hitting that at eight in no time. There we go. That's what I like to see. Oh, okay, what do we got here? Ah, uh, 
enemies spawn on this tile. Oh no, that's what that is. So two attack, three speed, two range. Nothing really too crazy about them. Neat. Uh, we don't have another attack. So that's fine. Did I... Oh, I didn't take the plant upgrade. That's right. Okay. Not the worst. We can just play all of our units just to get them on out. I probably should have moved him out of the forest just to guarantee. But at the same time, I can go ahead and just do self-inflicting damage on him. Like so. And that would be enough. I do believe. Yep, we got it. Attack. Perfect. Got it. Okay. Uh, I can do a poison attack on that if I so choose. So we're going to move to there. We'll move onto the button itself. And then we can do a bull rush to a poison shot. Beautiful. And that's about all I need to do right now. I have no means of healing these guys. Outside of the cactus juice one time. But not too worried on that at the moment. Okay, so... I'm going to want to move this guy over there so we can keep that from going. Get rid of that. Attack an enemy and add strike. Oh, that's right. Okay, so that's what that one is. Ooh, it destroys it. Oh, and it's a zero cost on that. Interesting. Okay. And he's got some range, too. Can only move one though. It's got an attack of two. But I can do multiple attacks. Attack of two. Da -da -da -da. I can do a bull rush. If we do a bull rush. Normal attack. Let's see here. Okay, so that's how that works. Good to know. We can do the knockback attack. This ain't gonna matter. He's just done for. Not too bad, not too bad. Gotta get ready for that guy, though. All right. So got him poisoned out. Each time a unit takes damage this turn, gain one energy and draw a card. Oh, okay, so I would utilize that uh, with my own self-inflicting damage, but I'd have to draw it first. Okay, we got a poison attack. We got these. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Two attacks on that would not really suffice on it. I said he's not going to be able to move much. Unfortunately, it looks like I have to do this. Even if I wanted to move through. Okay. If I did a full rush. Wouldn't really do much. Okay. So he's not going to be able to get to me. That's good. Mm. How do I want to do this? Go ahead and do that with a poison shot onto him. He's going to take two. 
Maybe one from this. Okay. And he hasn't even started to move yet. Okay. So he has an attack of three. And I can do a poison as well. Yeah, if I do this... Let's get rid of him. I'm basically going to be sacrificing this guy. Let's get a poison attack off and then another... Well, actually, I could... Bull rush him away. But I'm pretty sure he'll be able to get to there anyways. I could also do this. Actually. He's gonna be done for, and that's okay. Oh, we got him to move, too. So that's nice. Awesome, just two more units to take. Well, more than two, but it's just going to be the bat, which is no big deal. And this guy is not strong. Okay, so let's do you can move. And we'll bull rush you on through. Get that free poison off. Okay. That's about all I'm going to be able to do there. The bull rush is going to be pretty nice. Okay, let's bull rush you. He only does an attack of two. He's gonna be able to get to there, but that's okay. I don't think I need to play another one of those at the moment. But, might as well, because it's not like I really got much else to do at the moment. The rest is just getting to the flag now. Alrighty. So we're gonna attack. And then I'm gonna have to do this to get this kind of attack. One more attack. And then... Oh! Was one of them that we could just defeat all enemies? <laughs> Whoops! Troublemaker, huh? Okay, health of two with one armor and instigate. Okay, I got a lot of gold. I could be making a lot of stuff here. It all just depends on what's worth making at this point. All right, so what do we got off of this? Uh, target friendly unit takes one damage, flips back to motivate after use. Well, what's motivate do? Those are the questions that'll never be answered sometimes. Any of these worth taking? One attack, one speed, or full restore. I wonder what that would be like... Upgraded. It probably doesn't get destroyed. One attack, one speed, or full HP restore. This one is just gain poison attacks fully. 
The only thing I could see it being is that it would it would be worth one instead. Oh, let's see here. Curious what this would do. Got one of each of those. Definitely like having the two spatunias. Got my two upgrades. That's still decent to have. I kind of like the way this is all set up here. But... Because I have the two self-damage because those can get healed up because of the commander. I guess we can look to add it. I don't want my deck getting too big. But right now, with how many cards we just draw in general, just drawing a full hand makes it that, like, having more cards is not really bad at all. And let's go ahead and add him to that as well, and let's add both of these. And that should be pretty decent, I would think. Alright, what do we got up here next? Defend at least one beacon for ten turns. Don't lose any beacons. Okay, this sounds like it could be a little challenging. Not losing any beacons. Because I'm normally about getting everything all set up. Let's go back to my plant deck for this one. Oh, so it's only two beacons. Okay. So this is gonna be like another sprint to get to a thing. That's a horrible start. That's not even good either. And this is where it can get a little bit bad because of that. Uh Well, we might as well go ahead and move and get some attacks off. Yep, you get the counter attack. And that's fine by me. Beautiful. Up oh, them all out. That's okay. Hmm. Oh, that's right. Yeah, the water we can just completely cross over. Alrighty. Well, if I did that with that, I would be an instant death, obviously. Let's go ahead and move you up to there and get healed up. Alright. I don't really have much in movement at the moment. Man, all of my units are at the bottom. Not an ideal start, unfortunately. But that is going to happen sometimes. I got two attacks, so we can... I can move, attack, attack, uh, um... Well, and all my attacks... No, not all my... Not all of his attacks have knockback, right? It's just that one. If I did that, I mean, would that even be really worth it? Probably not. But should look to move up to there at the very least. He's safe. It really just kind of depends on what gets summoned out, but me not drawing any of my units is not ideal. Should be getting all my units now, though. Or at least the majority of them. Okay, let's see here. Oh, that's right. I forgot about that. And that's actually pretty nice to have. Oh boy, an attack of four. Gotta think about this. Let's get him out. Let's actually move him up to there. And we should be... It really just depends on what gets spawned out. That's fine. 
Oh, man, we got to get someone on that middle one. I do not want these guys spawning that much. That's a little... That's a little crazy. All right, I really don't have much in movement, unfortunately. But if I move you to there... Beautiful. Upgrade this guy. Ah, I can get the poison shot off though, but that's okay. Hmm. This is gonna be a little rough. Oh boy! My leader is not in a good spot! <laughs> Wow, you just really didn't want to deal with the kicker, huh? I mean, respectable, I get it. Okay. Uh, unit gains one attack. I might have to give that to my leader. Because my leader is not in a good state at the moment. I've only really got two movements right now. That thing is going to be taking a bit of a beating. Uh, who... I guess I'm going to want this guy to gain an extra attack. So this thing's gonna take some hits. Not ideal. I gotta send one of my Spatunias over to help the leader. This one could be challenging just in the case that I want to defend both of them. Although it's almost the end of the turn, so... Not bad. Oh, whoops. Three. I am think I'm going to want to upgrade this. Because I think I'm going to be able to need to move those extra tiles. Yep, with one extra damage, too. That's fine. Okay, and then... Which one's the upgraded one? You're my upgraded bad boy. So we gotta move him over there. And I should be safe. Because I should be gaining another armor, right? I might have messed that up and I actually lost. We'll see. I might have messed up. Crap, I lost the... Okay. That was an accident. That was a misplay. Losing my one armor with that attack like that. That was a roughly bad start to not getting any of my units. And once again, not getting any of my units. So that's not super great. But, at the same time, it's not the worst thing in the world right now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then we'll heal that one back up. I'd love to draw my unit soon, please! We had, like, a relatively good idea. I just... yeah. Okay, well, not one of the units I was hoping to get, but we can at least move them over to there for now. This is another unit to help out with this. Didn't get my upgrade with a unit I want to upgrade, but I'd really like to get a unit to keep that from taking hits at the moment. That'd be awesome. 
Well, at least I got a unit. With some relatively good speed. Motivate. Target friendly unit gains one speed and one attack this turn. Flips back to instigate. Interesting. He just doesn't really have great movement. And that's one of the issues. this time. Alright, give me my units. Give me my spatunias. I kind of need them right about now. And at least I got one of them. Can I get an upgrade? Nope. I don't even think I had. Yeah, so I think I lost both my upgrades, so... That's fine. Okay. Um... does have an attack of four. He's probably done for right now. Should I look to probably give him... This isn't, this isn't a great start again. I'd like to have an upgraded Spatoon if I can, but... This is not looking great either! Oh boy. He's done for! Awesome! Alright, this one's a little bit challenging, only in the sense that I'm trying to save both. Alright, and then we draw the waste immediately. How about that? Uh, an attack of five would be okay. I don't really have any movement either. Are you actually kidding me right about now? Okay, now I got the movement at least. Uh, let's get another attack. And one more. He's gonna be able to hit that. So he'll he'll just be completely dunzoed. Oh boy. Speed of two. One, two. So if I move up to there, I'll be okay. Get rid of this waste. We might be able to salvage this, maybe. But my leader being ganged up on again is not exactly the greatest. This is rough. I'm not getting my units as soon as I need them to. Yep, those counterattacks are really gonna hurt. I gotta do another reset here. I might actually need to go with this deck for Bull Rush, but also my main leader guy being there and him taking hits, making him stronger will be nice. Another one, which is fine, because then we'll do this, beautiful, and let's go ahead and get a succulent kicker out, just because, but I think having bull rush to be able to get my units to these faster is going to be nice, and I actually drew this guy away from that beacon, so that's good. Hey, I'm getting my units, let's go. 
All right. Um, I don't want to go over crazy with it because this guy being able to do four, obviously. Uh, let's get this guy out. I can wait on that. Let's... Hmm. A lot of my units don't really have a whole lot of health. But that's okay. Went right to the water. Interesting. I can bull rush him on through. I can put this guy behind there. That'll keep him relatively safe. Got my Spatunia and can upgrade him. So that's really good. Just bull rush through. We can play a Troublemaker and Spatunia. Okay, this is a better start. Much better start. I think Bull Rush is definitely what was needed to get this to work. All right, but now I need to make sure I get the, this taken care of. All right, so... I do want him to have that max health upgrade. It's a little dicey there, but we can do this and then bull rush. So that should be nice and well defended, I believe. I got my Spatunia upgraded, so I might as well give him the health upgrade right now and not wait on that. But I, with these two here, this should be nice and well guarded. I'd like to try and get those. Actually, I'd like to get the cactus guy up here if I can. Two self-damaging gains, one attack. I can give him an attack of four. That would be really good. Beautiful. So what's he sitting at? Three attack right now. He'll take a bit of a hit, but that's okay. I might have him do another attack, but we'll see. Attack of four with poison. So we can move to here for this. As I say, he's still a little bit out of range of that. We can play our other one. Okay, we're in a much better situation now. We got it this time. We got it this time. I promise. Nice, an extra two attack. He's in exactly where I want him to be. Eh, that's fine. Okay, let's see here. And then... Beautiful. kind of just have to do this, which will have me do this, 
And he's actually safe from that, so that's good. I have an attack of five. Kind of want him to get the extra armor right now. Because then when he gets hit now, he now has an attack of six, so I can one-shot those. Now, this guy might be a bit of an issue, but I am going to be... Oh, I forgot to attack with... Uh, okay, that was, that was a bad play. Bad play by me. I forgot to attack with my Spatunia, so that was horrendous. Okay. Alrighty. But yeah, he's now at six, so that's just gonna be a complete one tap. Which is good. Plus two damage. Beautiful. And he should have the attack of three, so we can move. Get the attack. And then bull rush him for that extra defense. This is working. This is working. Even with a misplay, this is working. Not not a good misplay on my part, but it's fine. Another extra attack. I love it. How many more turns do I have? Oh, we're on turn eight? Okay, so we're almost done. So we got the easy one shot there. We can move him to there. We can move... Okay, I need... Oh, that cost me two. Whoops. Okay. <laughs> well, that was a misplay. Uh, well, not terribly. Because I can just bull rush back to safety there. That's perfectly fine. Alright, I think I just got, what, one more turn that I need to defend? This monster deck's actually working out pretty nicely. But I feel like it's working out mostly nicely because of the extras that I need for this. Because just defending one of them would have been easy with the other deck. But the Bull Rush was definitely helpful there. Okay. So. I can get two attacks onto that. Uh. Dun, dun, dun. We'll attack you. And then we'll do that attack. And then we can do this attack. Get rid of that. Easy stuff. All we had to do was just draw draw our units within the first two turns. That's all it took. Not that. We can get rid of this waste. Let's say, and he... One, two... But he wouldn't be able to get over to there anyways. Even so, he's going to just move for extra defense there. We'll bull rush this guy because they've got nothing else to do right now. Done and done. Not a problem. <laughs> Took me a couple of retries, but hey, not a problem. Not a problem. Easy. All right. I can't imagine what the challenge on this one's going to be. This is the second one, and most second ones, though, usually are um, like a figure it out in one turn kind of thing, but we'll see. Whirlwind, huh? Because the moth itself ain't all that great, I don't think. It's only really two health. It's got some decent attack, though, so I guess that's something, but outside of that, I don't know what it would bring to the table. 